All right, now sometimes our dreams do come true, and in this case, I'm talking about Israeli singer Maya Buskila, who very recently took part in a very special project. Together with Grammy Award-winning artist Kelly Clarkson, the two sing in Hebrew on a new track called I Dare You, and several other versions and verses of the song appear in various other languages, including Spanish, French, and Arabic. But joining us now to tell us all about this amazing collaboration, we have Israeli pop star Maya Buskila herself. Maya, it is so great to have you here with us. Now, how, how did this collaboration with Thank Kelly you. Clarkson begin? Uh, well, actually, it's it's a weird story uh, for me. Like, it's really dream come true. Um, my people here uh, call me in the morning and said, "Do you do you care? Like, do you care to do a duet with Kelly Clarkson?" I said, "Oh yeah, I want to go to the moon also. So what?" So uh, he was laughing and said, no, no, really, really, you are going to do a duet with Kelly Clash? I said, come on, this is the fir April 1st, come on, don't, I'm, a, I'm in a really not good day, don't fool me. So uh, after I, I knew it's, it's really like going to happen, I was like, wow, I was like, it, it, was, it was blowing my mind and I... Um, started to, uh, in WhatsApp, start to um, teach Kelly Hebrew. Like, uh, at first, like, she had, like, in our uh, language, uh, there is resh, and she was like, resh. I said, no, 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 no. Like, it was a lot of takes oh, to do it. And, um, but it, it, it's, it's, you know, it's such an honor just to hear her sing in Hebrew and, um, this project make me uh, more proud of my my nationality, you know? Well, yeah, I mean, the, the project is amazing. Kelly's Hebrew is actually really impressive in the song, so I guess kudos very to you. Very impressive. It's I was like, wow. It's very she impressive. Said, I, like, she said to me, no, you are, you are too kind. <laughs> No, it's it's actually really good. Um, but so you know, what were what were some of the best responses that you've gotten for the song so far? Wow, actually, it's it's uh, it's uh, first place in all the radios in Israel right now, and um, all the people from Germany and from uh, uh, Morocco, uh, like you know, there are, there are many many people on the Instagram that that speak with me and tell me wow it's amazing like to find to find a true pure love you know no like really uh, um, really pure love without any any uh, uh, you know politic and nothing just to hear something and to love it not because you're Israeli or German or 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 Arab Arabic it's just because of the song, and I think this is what the project is all about, you know, uh, 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 free love and pure, not, without, without, like to accept the other and the different, and... Um, so, so that's it, I, w I wanted to actually talk about the message of the song. The song talks about unity, solidarity, and acceptance uh, of people who are different. Now, do you think that we in Israel are living by these values, especially now during this crisis? Oh yeah, I think people just uh, even even more because of this situation, like Corona situation, they are more uh, polite. They are more uh, they are accepting the other like more and uh, not to speak badly about each other. And I think it's help. It's helping. Like the song is came in in a, in the right place in the right situation. All right, well, again, it's a beautiful song. It, the, both you. the full version in Hebrew and the version in multiple languages, they're both super entertaining and, and incredible to hear. Maya, congratulations. It was Thank great you to very have you. Thank you so much. I hope you like it. I hope you love it. And uh, free love to everybody. Thank you so much.